Hello again, welcome to Friday Wrap for December 12th. Boy, you can tell winter's upon us, it's certainly uh, uh, dark already. Well, you know, it was a pretty quiet week, quiet week around the village overall, uh, starting with, uh, but we did have a village board meeting, a regular meeting of the mayor and board trustees was held on Monday, uh, December 8th. Only one item was pulled off the consent agenda by Trustee Bolas, who uh, wanted to ensure that the, uh, any the village was erasing any data uh, from any discarded or, or recycled hard drives. Uh, when um, we then concluded, or then conducted a, a public hearing uh, to discuss uh, the tax levy uh, and the request by the police pension board, uh, the board voted unanimously uh, to approve the recommendations set forth by the village administrator and the finance director. Uh, the meetings are also held uh, this week uh, for the restaurant and hotel marketing uh, committees, uh, but the board of fire and police commissioners meeting uh, that was scheduled for December 10th, that was canceled. Now, Burridge uh, Police Department, by the way, uh, is uh, also uh, now collecting toys for Toy Express. Uh, from now until December uh, 24th, uh, you're able to, uh, there'll be a box in the vestibule for collections, or you're, well, you're welcome to leave them at the front desk. Santa returns to the Village Center uh, this weekend, this Saturday, actually. It'll be at, it'll be at uh, Barbara's Bookstore from 11.30 a.m. to 2.30 p.m. Uh, feel free to, to bring your cameras and plenty, plenty of kids for this, uh, this opportunity. Uh, last time, last time before Christmas. And, uh, and by the way, you probably have already noticed the County Line Road Bridge uh, is finally, um, as, the week, uh, as the week progressed, so did the opening of the bridge uh, with the removal of the barriers. And as of today, as of Friday, the bridge is officially open. Uh, now, the electrical work on the bridge uh, will be, uh, should be complete before spring. Uh, and uh, the landscaping work will be done, as weather permits, uh, also in the spring of 2015. Uh, I say, okay, I'm a, bit, I'm a bit partial, but I do know that no other, no other town uh, in the state uh, has a nicer bridge than that one. Uh, it it's, it goes, it stretches across the interstate. And I'm especially happy about that because that was sort of one of the two reasons I originally uh, ran for mayor. I am excited about seeing that uh, completion uh, for next year. Uh, there was, you know, the other event uh, that happened in the village this week was a Boost uh, Marketing Committee, a marketing uh, group, I'm sorry, Boost Creative Marketing, who handles all the uh, marketing uh, for the hotel, hotels and uh, restaurants in the village. Uh, they sponsored a, a special uh, little uh, holiday, uh, holiday party uh, this weekend, or this week, at the County Wine Merchant. Uh, that was uh, well attended by uh, many of the uh, trustees, planning commissioners, business owners, uh, people, uh, managers from the local businesses, uh, as well as restaurants and hotels. Uh, the food was catered by Cooper's Hawk, and the, the desserts were by Kirsten's Bakery. It was there that I was also, also able to uh, learn more about all the renovations, the major renovations that are occurring over at the Quality Inn, as well as Spring Hill Suites. Well, thank you again for joining me uh, for the Friday Wrap. I hope you have a great week and a great weekend as you prepare for the Christmas season coming up.